The investigation continues tonight into a horrific accident here in Fall River. We first reported it live at 5 on WPRI 12. An elderly man was critically injured when he was underneath a car. I would assume reporter Shante Lance is live outside Rhode Island Hospital where the man was taken this afternoon. Mike, that's right. That elderly man has been here at Rhode Island Hospital for about 12 hours now. Fall River police say that he actually was uh, continues to recover tonight after he was struck and pinned by his own family member. Shockwaves tear through a quiet, close-knit Fall River community after police say a vehicle accidentally struck and pinned an 84-year-old man outside of his own home on Pittman Street. It's really sad because I've always seen him and his wife. I couldn't believe my eyes. Neighbor John Costa lives across the street. I said hi to him, so I started walking down the street. And uh, I got a little ways down the street, and all of a sudden I heard tires screeching and a big bang. Police left these orange marks where neighbors say that pickup truck was running before it accidentally accelerated and hit that 84-year-old man and pinning him to a red SUV. Police say the elderly man was freed from underneath the park vehicle and rushed to Rhode Island Hospital with life-threatening injuries. Costa tells Eyewitness News the elderly man's own son was the driver. Police say the vehicle may have had a mechanical issue. This was a bad day, you know, just really a bad day for him. And I just, I'm praying that he's going to, you know, he's going to be okay. I hope he's going to be, you know, do good and make it through this. And the second cousin of that victim tells me that a lot of their family is here tonight. They say they're remaining hopeful. Reporting live at Rhode Island Hospital with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Shante Lands, Eyewitness News.